Hello, I'm Paul Douglas. With Boss's Tone Studio software, you can fully configure your Katana Mark II amp, adding new effects, uh, tone settings, that's patches, tone settings is Boss's terminology. You can download other people's sounds to it, uh, back up your amp settings to your computer, loads of stuff like that. In this video, I'm going to show you how to get started with the Tone Studio, i.e. how to download and install the software, and how to physically connect your Katana to your computer. Please subscribe, click the bell, like and share this video. There's three things you are going to need. One, a computer to uh, run the Tone Studio on. Two, a cable to connect your computer to your Boss Katana. And three, the actual Tone Studio software downloaded from Boss. I can't help you with a computer. You'll have to find one of those yourself. Um, now the cable that you need is uh, actually like this. Uh, the key points being you need the ends uh, to be uh, like this. Now, this is a, a USB printer cable. If you search on Amazon or wherever for USB printer cable, should return you loads that are suitable. Here's uh, an example of one that will do just fine. I shall put a link to one in the description below. Okay, so assuming we have a computer to run the software on and a cable to connect the amp up to your computer. All we need now is the actual uh, Boss Tone Studio software downloaded. Now to do this, what I suggest you do is just, just Google for something like Boss Tone Studio Katana Mark II Download, Windows 10 if you're on Windows maybe. Uh, so Boss Tone, whoops, <laughs> Tone Studio uh, Katana Mark to download Windows 10. There we go. So let's uh, click on that link at the top there. And we've gone to uh, Boss's website, as expected. If we look here, Boss uh, Tone Studio for Katana Mark II version 102 for Windows. Let's click on that. Now, if I remember correctly, go down to the bottom, agree, and wish to proceed with download and download the file. So I'm going to save that into where I save my uh, music stuff. Uh, here we go. If I uh, open that location, let's uh, extract that out of there. Hey, you can see we've got that BTS Katana 2 W102 uh, folder there. And here's the installer. So we install this in the usual way. Double click the installer. There we go, wait until that's finished. Doesn't take very long. Perfect. Uh, I'll just unclick that because I won't launch it at this point. Brilliant, so Tone Studio is now installed. Now, with the Boss Katana turned off, connect the Katana Mark II and the computer together with the USB cable. Now, this is the back of the Katana the uh, socket that you want to connect the cable to connect to your computer is labeled USB. You can see that just, just there. So this end, so sort of, I don't know, squarish end of the cable is going to go into that USB uh, socket. So into there it goes, yep. And then the other end, which is more like a, a normal looking uh, USB cable, I think that's a, I can't remember what it's called, a USB 2, I think. Um, there we go. That is the thing that's going to go into your computer. So find a spare uh, USB port in your computer. And as usual, you always try it the wrong way around first. Uh, there we go. So computer, one end of the cable, and Boss Katana, other end of the cable. So we're connected up computer connected to Katana, we can now turn the Katana on. Now, if the device driver that you need um, for your computer to talk to the Katana, if that's not installed, it should get installed automatically uh, when you connect your Katana to your computer and turn it on. Okay, all connected up. So now we should be able to run the software. So if I go to my uh, start menu, pick on uh, Boss Tone Studio for Katana Mark II there, click on that. Wait a few seconds. 
There you go. Up it comes. And there we go connected to the katana because i've connected up uh, my computer with tone studio to the katana before it went straight went straight into it what you'll probably see when you first connect up to it is a little uh, options dialogue to ask you which uh, device you want to connect to uh, looking a bit like this just pick katana there and uh, you should be good to go so now we're in and we're all connected up and you can see that's what we've got in our katana at the moment. So ju just to prove the point, I pick my guitar up. There we go. Uh, sell it to the brown sound. If, if I just switch this dial, let's switch it to clean. Or crunch. I know. Let's let's add an effect. Uh, maybe a bit of uh, chorus. So there you go, you can see I am controlling my katana with the Boss Tone Studio software. So that's how to get Tone Studio software connected up and talking to your katana. Look out for more videos coming up showing you how to use the incredibly powerful Tone Studio software. Thanks very much for watching, please subscribe and click the bell. Keep making music and I'll see you again in the next video. Cheers.